Hi, I'm Natalie Ruiz. Here at Chance and Water, we love educating people and we love exposing myths. So I had something really annoying happen the other day. One of my customers called me and she said that her chiropractor had told her, oh, you don't need to buy an ionizer. All you have to do is put lemon in your water and that'll raise the pH. So I thought that would be a great test for us today. I haven't pre-done this. I would say this lemon's probably been sitting in this water for about 15 minutes at this point, which is probably a lot longer than you would ever have it in there before you drank it. But let's go ahead and test. What I've done is I've poured two glasses of tap water, unfiltered tap water, had to go into our bathroom to get that. Um, and, and let's test it. We're gonna do it two different ways and see what we come up with. We'll start with the water without the lemon. And that is testing at about a 7.0, 7 uh, pH. So it's going up just a little bit. Here in um, Laguna Hills, we have neutral tap water, which is federally regulated to be neutral, which is in the 7 range. So that was what we would expect. It's up to about 7.42. And we're going to go over here to the one that has had the uh, lemon in it and see what that is. Well, interestingly enough, it is not more alkaline. It's more acidic, and it's at a 3.51 at this point. That is not improving alkalinity in any way, shape, or form, so that's a complete and total myth. Um, I'd heard that one many times myself and always assumed it to be true, but it's kind of fun to just double check things out, and we have just proven that one to be false. You're not raising the alkalinity of water by putting a lemon in it. I want to go one step forward and test the ORP of both of these and see what the difference is in that direction. Now I want you to remember that the um, pH scale is a logarithmic scale. It's similar to our earthquake scale in that the difference between one point is actually a hundred times uh, difference. So the difference between a three or a four and a seven is huge. Okay. We're going to turn on our ORP meter, and I'm expecting them both to be positive since um, there wasn't a great alkalinity issue there. Um, I've turned on the meter. These are lab quality meters. Let's start with our tap water. And the tap water is, well, it is dropping, but we're just below 400 in the positive ORP. That means the regular tap water, unfiltered tap water, is oxidizing, which is not the greatest thing for you. That causes you to age. Uh, it's the exact opposite of an antioxidant, which attacks free radicals. And let's go over here to the one with the lemon in it and see if there was any benefit that way. Well, it's um, this one is a 412, 42. So that one's dropping a little bit too. 389, they're very similar in ranges. So other than the fact that the lemon made the water much more acidic, I don't see any benefit whatsoever to drinking your water with lemon in terms of alkalizing your body or causing it to be antioxidant. I really hope that helps. Have a wonderful day.